Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Radars are one of the most important component of a fighter jet which has evolved from time from PESA to gallium arsenide based AESA and now to gallium nitride based AESA radar. India's premier research institute DRDO is working on developing various types of uttam AESA radar which will power the future fighter jets of India such as LC Tejas Mark 1A, LCA Mark 2, AMCA and TBF. The Uttam FCR AESA radar being developed for Indian Air Force is going to have four variants. The first one is going to be gallium arsenide based AESA radar developed for LCA Tejas Mark 1A. The next two versions are going to be scaled up version of the baseline Uttam with more densely packed TR modules being developed for LCA Mark II and Su-30 MKI. The fourth version will be a gallium nitride based semiconductor, a more advanced version which is under development for AMCA and TEDBO fighter jets. The Uttam AESA radar which is being developed for LCA Mark one a will have 780 TRMs. It is a full solid state gallium arsenide based AESA radar. It has total 8 modes in air to air, air to ground, air to sea roles. The X band antenna has 780 TR modules. The radar has been able to track an LCATS Mark 1 from a range of 140 km, which is quite significant as LCA is the smallest fighter in its category and has good stealth characteristic due to the usage of composite. AES radar has 95% indigenous component with only one imported subsystem. It has capacity to track 100 targets in the sky at range of 100 kilometers and engage four of them simultaneously. The Uttam radar has been fully flight tested in all modes. The radar is being flight tested on two Tejas Mark 1 fighter as well as on Hawker 800 executive jet for over 250 hours. The National Flight Testing Center, which is manned by Indian Air Force, has already green-lighted the radar after successful performance test. Now, after the successful completion of Uttam Ace radar program on 26th August 2022, DRDO has formally completed the transfer of technology for production of the Uttam radar to Hindustan Aeronautics Limited. HAL will be the lead integrator of the radar for Tejas Mark 1A with four identified vendors, which includes BEL being the key supplier of subsystem. Earlier, HL has reported to integrate Uttam ASA from 21st unit of LCTS Mark 1A. However, the Delhi Defense Review has reported that this Mark 1A will be equipped with Uttam ASA radar from 41st unit. Now, as per the latest report from the new Indian Express, the light combat aircraft LC Tejas Mark 1A will be the first set of fighter jets to be fitted with Uttam ASA radar in next six months to one year. Post the integration of LCA TS Mark 1A, the advanced fighter jets such as Su-30 MKI and MiG-29 will be integrated with this radar system. The process of integration of Uttam on all these platforms would begin by the year 2025. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.